fresh. Oh, yeah. See you again. See you. Ready to go out and have a look at some of the holes on yeah, the golf course? To it. Yeah, yeah, great. Yeah, Let's go. Seven, Josh. Yeah. Here's your new tea box. Obviously, looking down over the three sisters below us. But I've got a surprise for you. I want to take you up to our new professional tea. Uh, oh wow. This is something special up here. So obviously, this used to be the pro tea for the tent. Yeah. And we noticed that they're obviously quite close together. So we were able to morph the two into one and create this incredible new tee for the seventh hole and you'll also notice down there that the three sisters have got a bit of a facelift too the bunkers have become bigger more aesthetic and a lot of tree removal down the left and right hand side oh, it's incredible yeah i don't know if i'd back myself <laughs> from here it's a bit of a longer yeah. carry from down here now but look us mortals will only have to worry yes. about this team box 2022 has been a fantastic year for irish rugby but you've also had an amazing year personally what have been the highlights for you this year well, i suppose i have to mention i got married this year first firstly i'd say my wife would be very pleased to have to mention that first um that was probably the highlight of the year Apart from the wedding, uh, <laughs> winning in New Zealand, like winning, the tour, that winning the tour in New Zealand, um, that was probably, yeah, that has to be right up there anyway, it was a, it was a very pleasing year. Fairway, we'll have a look from Let's the fairway on the green. To. I'd love to. Excellent. And a lot of people might not realise that you're actually a pretty handy golfer, Josh, like you're eight uh, handicap now. Off eight, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, I can only imagine what that handicap would be if you had more time. <laughs> but uh, no, I've I seen you. more time. I've seen you hit a ball quite a few times. You're you're well able to strike a golf oh, thank ball. Thank you. Yeah, no, it's it's my um, it's my like getaway from from rugby or stress or anything yeah. like that. If I'm if I get a chance, uh, busy time or I get a chance just to get out for nine holes or to the yeah. driving range for a bit, it's you're just focusing on trying to play as well as you can on the golf yeah. course and you forget about other things. So yeah, no, yeah. I love it. One thing you alluded to on the drive down. Your bunker friends, short yeah. left and right, are gone. The greens obviously got much bigger. New USGA spec green, but just for a bit of divilment, we've left a steep runoff in left down to the water. But the higher handicaps will have the opportunity to run the ball run, yeah. in up the right. Gosh, it's incredible. Yeah. This is a test for you now, because yeah. my dad or someone, my dad would be experienced man yeah he'd, yeah, he'd run it on the edge yeah. and i'd be like you know what i'm gonna do the we're gonna try to rory mcelroy and spin it right onto the yeah, flag I, i'd like to know more about the standard of golf be it leinster rugby ireland rugby or retired players okay so who's the best player you've played with um, i'd say jordan larmer he'd just be like oh, i hit it he'll hit a nice high draw off the tee and he'd just be like you just roll your hands it's like <laughs> taking a free kick it's just a very simple in his head um, um, he's a very impressive golfer, yeah, very, very good. And contrasting to that, who's the worst player on uh, Don't Be Shy now? <laughs> For the amount he plays, Caelan Doris is probably the worst <laughs> player. But he's actually getting very, he's getting much better. But for the amount he plays, it has to be him. And who'd be the guy that would have all the best gear, all the best clothes? Well, maybe not the game to support it. Immediately, the thing that popped into my head was one of the Carney brothers. <laughs> so I'd say I'd probably have to go at Rob with that. Um, where he likes his, he likes his tight, tight golf tops. Final question for you: Who's the biggest bandit out there? Do you know, I played with Andrew Porter not so long ago, and we gave him some crazy handicap. Might have been like 25 or something, and he was very, very good. Real natural, hits the ball well. Yeah, he was. He, he, he'd be, he'd be probably the biggest bandit.